heard something up ahead. God damn it! Ambush! Cover people! What? Watch yourself! Stay low! Oi, white legs don't leave survivors often. You're some kind of lucky, let me tell you. You came from outside, didn't you? From the civilized lands. Wow, Joshua will want to hear about this. Joshua Graham, he leads our tribe. Thanks to him, the dead horses are strong and safe from our enemies. He'll want to talk to anyone coming up from Southways. I guess that means just you now. Come, I can take you to him. Good cysts. We head east then. Joshua is at our tribe's camp in the Eastern Virgin. See that log over there? Take a closer look. There might be some good stuff tucked in there. We follow this path for a while. Nice view of the river. Yeah.
freeze. Don't move. That was some kind of lucky. Guess that one was all full of gecko, eh? <laughs> Don't get used to it, though. Yao Guai are plenty mean as a rule. You can take the path north here if you want. Or head east over the ridge. There's a nice view from the top of that cliff, if you want to look. Nearly there. You see the dead sentries? My soul, like the shadow of a ghost. Those handprints? Dead horses and sorrows mark them on taboo places. Places from back when. Good thing for you, I don't buy into that stuff. against other tribes. Lots more of them since Joshua came to us. Nearly there now. Watch out for traps in the water. Got to keep the white legs out somehow. Eh? Here we are. Joshua's just ahead there, and the angel came. Auslander Zuka Joshua Graham. You know our tongue. Smart, Auslander. Joshua in high place of cave. You show respect, Utman. Joshua is greatest warrior. You show him no respect. He show you thunder and fire. You wise for Auslander. We 
should have given you a better welcome on your first visit to Zion. But from what I hear, the White Legs beat us to it. White Legs seem to be the only visitors we have these days. And I wouldn't have expected anyone from the Mojave to come looking for us. And you're a courier, no less. Not the one I was expecting, but I suppose he wouldn't have come with a caravan. I don't know if you were close to the other members of your group, but you have my sympathy. I pray for the safety of all good people who come to Zion, even Gentiles. But we can't expect God to do all the work. The dead horses are capable scouts. Nothing passes into or out of Zion without my hearing of it. Happy trails. I remember. They were good friends. I have bad news for your employers. New Canaan was destroyed, its citizens scattered. All because of the White Legs. And Caesar, of course. The White Legs want to join the Legion. Caesar's rite of passage is the destruction of the New Canaanites, almost assuredly because of me. The good news is that we can help you find your way back. Daniel, one of the other New Canaanites, has made many maps of the region. The bad news is that we can't help you right now, not with everything that's going on. You're a good neighbor to us. We all go through periods of darkness. In such times, we can turn to the Lord. But it's good to have friends. Daniel and I need pre-war tools to help us navigate beyond Zion. Should we need to evacuate, these instruments will be vital to us. Normally, we would have some of the dead horses or sorrows look for them. But many pre-war buildings in the valley are taboo. They won't go inside. Thank you. Follow Chomp can help you find your way around the valley. He's inexperienced, but he knows enough of our language to ignore the taboos about pre-war building. 